All right. Well, this is Adam with Play P. And unfortunately, I made the horrible mistake of betting the VR grid on. We had a little bet about Roller Coaster Legends, and unfortunately, I I did lose that bet. And the most, the worst thing we could think of as far as a punishment would be to play. Stunt Kite Masters VR. So although Alex is going to love this, and obviously VR Grid is going to love this, I am, ha you know, actually, before I get started, I'm going to put a stopwatch on my phone right here. I'm going to do that right now, because I am to play 30 minutes of this. Not, I'm putting it, I'm doing dang timer. I'm going hardcore. 30 minutes. 30 minutes on the clock it's actually also exactly 10 o'clock so i could have just remembered 10 30 but whatever so i have 30 minutes of stunt kite master vr to talk about to play and hopefully random crap to talk about and if i'm lucky maybe i'll have some friends drop in and we can also talk other vr games but that's that's where we're at here folks oh no see it, it just doesn't make any sense this this thing like okay so technically I should be able to let it just sit here but actually maybe it can fine this I'm gonna say this is what I'm gonna do suck on that VR grid I am just going I'm not gonna play the game I'm gonna sit here while the kites up in the air and I'm gonna enjoy sitting on the beach see look I'm not moving why I guess the wind is supposed to move but I'm just gonna talk I can talk to myself for days I feel like most of the time I'm talking to myself during the podcast anyhow so I'll just talk to myself that's how I'm gonna play this actually I'm gonna go to that one city level that was pretty cool I as I mentioned about this game before the environments they created are, are kind of cool. I like those, but it's just these stupid games. So this one's useless. How do we switch a game? Yeah. Uh, Kite Snake. So this also didn't make any effing sense to me until Alex explained it. So you can't run into your own tail. Which I, I didn't know that. I thought the whole point was you just get these stupid stars and you be sure that you don't run into the ground. I didn't realize that you couldn't hit your tail. Oh my, it is so hard to control this thing. Okay. There's one. What's funny is they actually thought people would be good enough Oh yeah, oh yeah, four, that's a record, five, five, six, I, dude, look at me go, where, where's, what do you see that, yeah, they put it right on the ground, what dicks, okay, okay, 11, that's like a, that's gonna be my all time record, Watch this, I'm going to swoop down and... Oh! That would have been cool. But couldn't, couldn't get the mustard. Couldn't suck the mustard? There's some type of... There's some type of phrase. Oh! Yo! Dual... Sh whatever your name is, what up? Dude, I am so glad someone stopped by because this game is going to drive me nuts. And I have the VR grid to thank for it. If you see them, tell them they sucks. Will you do that for me? Oh. No. Come on. Do you have this game? Oh, dang it. Or do you like it? Because my partner in crime, my play PSVR partner, he loves this game. Absolutely loves it. And I don't understand it. Okay. Let's change... Lo I need a little change in location. What do you think about that? Do we want cities or mountains? Let's go to the city. Because I was kind of looking forward to that. 
Let's do it. Oh, first timer, huh? Well, so I'm using the move controllers. I've used both. The move controllers are definitely better, as you would probably expect, right? Um, and there are three different environments. There are three different game modes. This game mode, you can't hit your tail. Oh, oh, it's so hard to control. So you can't hit your own tail and you have to collect the stars. Oh, look, dude, I'm doing so much better than the first time I played this. You should have seen the first time, dude. It was ugly. Oh, that's dirty. They got me real close. Making me think of, come on, there it is. Ooh. Come on. Oh. So my high is 11. Oh, oh, what was that? Oh, I hit my tail. Oh, high score for this. I guess they do it per level. Okay. First time seeing Stunt Kite Master, huh? Do you, how long have you had your PSVR? Or do you have a PSVR? Yeah, the, the game itself, I do like the environments. Like, they do look good. Um, oh, what? How the heck did I not hit that? That's bullcrap. But the environments do look good. And there's only three of them. So that's possibly, you know, a disadvantage. But, I mean, the game, I think, is only $5 or something like that. So, I mean, we're not talking about a big investment to begin with. And... Oh. I mean, I certainly, I lost a bet, which is why I'm playing this game, and to the VR grid, which is why I wanted you to tell him that he sucks, but I can't imagine really playing this game much more than 30 minutes at a time. Oh, you only have VR for two days? Oh, man. Oh, dude, I remember when I first got my VR. What? Dude. What great days. Are you trying to figure out what games you want to buy? Which ones do you already have? Where's... Oh, there's that star. There's that star. Ooh, couldn't get there. It's hard to get down that low. Ooh, then I went too far. Here, let me show you the other, one more location, and then we'll do a different game mode so you can see the, that guy is, what, two minutes, what are you talking about two minutes, two minutes, I don't know what you're talking about, you mean I've only been, I've only been, surely you don't mean I've only been playing two minutes because I will shoot myself. Dude, you know Ultra Wings? I've played Pirate Flight, but I haven't played Ultra Wings. Uh, my my partner Alex has, and the and he really likes it. So it doesn't surprise me that you've played so much of it. Oh, dude. Okay. Well, here's the thing, dude. I think it's first of all, it's very short. I don't care. Eight minutes is very short, but. I think on the podcast, I was probably just kind of like, you know, dicking around saying, oh, yeah, it's like two minutes, like in exaggeration. I knew it was short, but, and uh, yeah, I, you know, I exaggerate, but I use that same exaggeration over and over. So VR Grid thought that I was serious. And I mean, once he kind of called me out on it, I was like, dude, wh whatever, like, I just played along with it. I didn't really think it was two minutes. Although eight minutes, I don't know if I would have guessed eight minutes. But regardless, yeah, here we are. I figure it's all in fun and games, right? I paid five bucks for this game. I might as well play it while I can. And Oh, oh I got plus five. That's not worth it when you die. Don't play with Ryan. I don't know. Am I missing something? Ryan. I don't know who you're talking about. I Oh, dang it. Stupid mountain. Stupid mountain. Is there a platinum 
in Stunt Kite Master? Because that would be hilarious if there were. No! Yeah! Oh, gosh! I hate it when they put these things so far down. Oh, that is right. Duh. Okay. That is right. I've been calling him VR Grid for so long that... Because even on our podcast, he... I guess we did say Ryan from the VR Grid. But that's just how I know him. I don't really call him Ryan. What do you think about Ultra Wings, Will? Um, I don't know. The other guy who is on here, he was talking. He's had his PSVR for two days. I don't know if he's still in the chat or not, but... Uh, and he was just saying that he played a whole lot of Ultra Wings so far. And that's one I actually haven't played yet. Is it better than Pirate Flight? Yeah, maybe I need to... I'm so cheap, that's the problem. Maybe I need to buy it. They added, uh, do either of you have the flight stick? Because I really want to use the flight stick. Dude, you can't get a lot better than Pirate Flight. You maybe could get a little better. You can't get a lot better. What are you talking about, Will? What are you talking about, Willis? <laughs> you see kind of what I did there? Yeah, Alex found some that were like 50 bucks on Amazon or something but I just really don't even have any games that are compatible okay yeah well just so you know Pirate Flight is another Ultra Wings kinda look-alike but it is it's much worse so I'm not actually being serious when I say you should get it look into it but um, you know it's it's very limited Although I will say the person who develops it cares a lot. He keeps... Dang it! No! Oh! Do you have... So right now there is a... Uh... Oh, okay. I see. I see. I misunderstood you. They have a huge... Um... Did you get it on that huge PSVR sale? Or I guess it's just an all-game sale, not just PSVR. Because there are some pretty nuts looking sales. Oh, Bob Saget. There's some pretty great sales out there right now. Have um Ooh. Oh. Have either of you played um a hundred foot robot golf? Because that thing's only two bucks. And I'm really thinking about buying it. Actually, unless someone tells me that it's outright horrible, I'm going to buy it. How could it be that? Oh, oh what? I killed it. Let's go. How could it be that bad, you know? I mean, I've played... Stunt Kite Master. I've played Herocade. I've played... No! Oh, crap. I played some real crap here. Exactly. Like, two bucks. At that point, it would be fun just to play for 30 minutes and make fun of. Oh, they use some pretty, uh... Tits. They use some pretty uh, good sounding lyrics there. Come on. Does it? What what type of <laughs> redeeming quality does it have? Oh yeah, Dol Sugar. I'm just gonna say Dol Sugar. I don't know how you actually say it. The uh, the it's it's just so limited, but it's a shorter game and it's definitely. Like, you know, it's priced appropriately. I think it's really cheap, right? If you like Ultra Wings a whole lot, it may be worth just going and getting that. I mean, he keeps putting updates out with, uh, I think, maybe new maps. And uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh. Oh. 
Let's go. Let's go. Yeah, um... Well, Bob Saget. Dude, Dread Halls was not that good. It was... It was boring. It wasn't even that scary. Come on. Come on, mister. Oh, dang it. Okay. Here we go. Get off my butt. Riveting my butt, dude. Oh, stupid. Like, it was just so boring. Dude, I don't know. I, I could see how maybe it was a little suspenseful. Look, like, I don't understand what you're supposed to do, like, right there when they have a little remote guy coming at you that directly. There's nothing you can go do. At least this guy, I saw him in advance. I mean, I still... <laughs> To hit him straight on, <laughs> but at least, like, I can see him coming. This is a very bad mode, but I mean, I gotta do something. I hate kites. I hate everything. I hate all of these. I don't just hate one mode. I hate them all. Oh my gosh. Dude, I have 14, and I'm only halfway done. Oh my gosh. I am never going to bet that man again. That or I'm at least going to pick something. How do I, can't I like, can't you unlock different kites? There are more than three kites, right? No, there's not. Ooh, no, that's cool. Dude, that's insane. 13. But the thing is, those 13 are going to suck real bad, aren't they? I love how the, the kite they give you to begin with is the best. Oh my gosh, look, I'm not even gonna look at those. Okay, game modes. I don't want, I don't want that. What's custom mode? Wow, there's actually more song tracks than I thought. Oh yeah, grooving. Like, what is this? You just fly a kite? Like, <laughs> this is the dumbest thing. I quit playing uh, Red Matter for the time being because I was like, okay, I want some action. And this, and I was like, I want some action in this way. I ended up choosing. How stupid. Dude, I still don't think Alex is in love with it. He just... I don't know what to tell you, Will. I need to play it soon because I invested too much money in it not to play it more. So I need to I need to play it. Get some more avatars, the only thing worth. Yeah, it's in it's in a it's in a top five for me too, man. Top five worst. Okay, that's not true. Top five most overrated ever. No! That stupid kite. Okay, cool. Thanks for stopping by, buddy. Hopefully I'll catch you later. He's a cool guy. I wonder, uh, I wonder what country he's from, cause his, no, ah, oh, no, no, it's, it's impossible on this piece of trash.
Ooh, you see me fly right through the rock to that well? I bet you can. Like, I, I can't think about why someone would want to do this. Like, why would someone be sitting there with PSVR headset on and be like, you know what? I want to fly this kite. I, I just, I can't. I can't think of it. I keep wanting to play it at oh there's only I see there's only one night level but it showed you what it would look like if you played it at night. yeah th this is I think easily my favorite level you got lightning you got a helicopter over there well yeah, well, so the problem was all last week I was gone for training for work, and then the week before that there was, I forgot what game it was, I had a game but it had an embargo so I couldn't play it, and then here I was like, well, I have to show the VR grid that I actually played the game, so he, uh, so I did it on YouTube, because he's more active on YouTube than he is on Twitch. I did, although I'm a little confused, so when I played Red Matter, so I have a EU and a North American account, and they gave me an EU code for Red Matter, so I put it in that account. And I thought as long as it was on the same PlayStation 4, that you would be able to play it on any account, regardless of which one you downloaded it to. But when I tried to play it on my American account, it wouldn't let me. So I had to go to my EU account, which doesn't have Twitch or YouTube set up, so I couldn't play it on Twitch either. But yeah, I thought you would be able to play that on either one, because you download it to the PlayStation, but apparently I'm wrong, because I wasn't able to play it. Yeah, we, I don't, we've gotten several codes that are EU, and we could contact people and be like, hey, can we rather have a North American one? But then that delays, you know, potentially getting the code, and I don't know, we just found it easier to make an EU account and, and roll with it. Because some... I know definitely some developers can give you EU codes because they get them a lot earlier than the North American ones. So, oh, I was on a on a roll there. That kite sucks. What? Oh yeah, man. So we, uh, actually both Will and I, we have our own, we have a website that, uh, Will does the, a lot of reviews on YouTube. It's actually mainly on YouTube. And, uh, I help run a website called Play PSVR where we review games and accessories. We have a podcast. And so a lot of times we get pretty much a lot of the games to review. That way we can do reviews of them and ultimately help fans decide which ones are worth buying so they don't waste their money. So I do that with my buddy Alex for Play PSVR and then the guy talking with us here, Will, he has his own channel. You should check him out. He does a lot more YouTube stuff. Alex and I tend to do a little more Twitch and our reviews are written, and we we have a podcast where we actually talk about them as well. But we 
I don't do quite as much YouTube, but yeah, so Will and I are lucky to have played, I don't know, how, what percent of the overall PSVR games available do you think that you've played and reviewed well? I'm thinking Alex and I combined at least probably have 80, 80 of them. Dude, no. I'm not doing it. You have to pick another game. I'm not playing this game for another 15 minutes. This is horrible. I'm just waiting for my timer to go off. Like, look, I can't even do anything. Oh. Well, that's not bet. You probably do. No, I'm not guessing wrong. I'm not doing it. <laughs> I'm playing that game. Get out of here, son. I don't even... I, I would probably guess you, because from the discussions I've had with you, it sounds like you also buy them. And I, I don't buy them. So... Dude, it's all good. We love everybody, no matter what language you're speaking. Speak Zimbabwean. You can speak... Spanish, French, it doesn't matter, dog. I don't care. Because in VR, there is no language. So, we're all good. Where are you from? What country, if you don't mind me asking? No! Heck, you might be in America for all I know. What the heck? If you look at my kite, it's a little UFO. <laughs> That's cool. Oh, that sucks. Well, dang it. Well, yeah, that's unfortunate. Well, if you if you have any questions, just uh, let me know. Like, if there are any games that you're specifically interested in, or. Or if you just have a general question, you've already made my night a lot better. Because playing this game 30 minutes by myself would be very painful. And you've pretty much been here the whole time, which I very much appreciate. Oh, dude, Germany. Dude, I need I wanna go to Germany. But I haven't yet. If there's one place to visit in Germany, where would it be? that hard look at that stick I feel like it would be much harder and much more chaotic trying to fly it right oh, oh let's see how much longer I got oh baby two minutes I've only got two minutes more well, forget you, VR Grid. You suck, buddy. So, have fun being sure that I never bet you again. Unless we make it clear that the the loser doesn't have to play more stunt type master. Then I might do some more bets. But, I am not betting you for more stunt type masters playing. I mean, 30 minutes was... That this is 30 minutes I'll never get back to. So thank you for for wasting my time and for making me feel like a big fat loser. Because that's exactly how I feel. But this is my favorite level. Uh, cool. Thank you, buddy. Yeah, I will. Um, yeah, I'm sure I'll I'll definitely see you around if you. Um, get a chance yeah feel free to go check out the website too we love having people heck dude if you want to join a podcast we'd love to have you 
we, even if your English isn't great, we don't care. We'll gladly talk to you and we'll just have a good, we'll have a good time. So, if interested, just look us up. Not including, oh, okay, so not including the free one. I don't know what I have. That seems like a lot. Yeah, and unless I get them very early, I had to pay for them, but because, you know, we, we didn't have to play PSVR going. But once we did, I about only buy a game if it's like a big name, big name title. And, uh, wait, how can you count mine? you ha get access to the game? What happened if I've deleted games? Because, like, I've uh, bought games and then deleted them off my PS4 because they haven't sucked. Can you see those? There it is. I don't know if you hear that. Right here. Do you, do you hear that? Yeah, that's my timer. Time's up, boys. Time to go get a real life. Quit playing this freaking game. So, thank to both of you for stopping by and making <laughs> making this a tolerable experience. And I will catch the both of you later. And remember, Will, I did not attempt to make a bet with you. I did not lose, and I did not play more Stunt Kite Masters. Or rather, I will. So peace out. Have a great night. Okay, nice. I won. That's why I love. I like winning. Not used to it. But I'm going to enjoy it while I got it. Peace out, guys.